In the boundless expanse of the cosmos, where the stars whisper the secrets of the universe, lies a mystery as ancient as life itself, hidden within the very fabric of our being. Welcome to Soul Compass, your sanctuary of mystical wisdom, where we unveil the veils of reality to reveal truths that have slumbered in the shadows of our existence. Today, we embark on an extraordinary journey into the depths of our own physiology to uncover a sacred secret that has been etched into the annals of time. This secret holds the key to the regeneration of our bodies, guided by the celestial dance of the cosmos and an elixir so potent it is named after the divine self, the Christ oil. What is this oil that traverses the spine, anointing every cell it touches with the potential for rebirth and enlightenment? Why did the ancients equate it with Christ, and how does its cyclical journey mirror the spiritual ascension described in revered texts? Prepare to unlock the secrets of the Christ oil, the divine elixir that lies dormant within you, waiting to be awakened and raised. Let us journey together through the sacred corridors of our inner universe, illuminating the path to higher consciousness and the divine potential that resides within us all. Welcome to this mystical exploration. Welcome to Soul Compass. In the vast tapestry of the cosmos, a celestial dance takes place every month, orchestrated by the moon. This dance is not just a spectacle of the heavens, but a profound influence on our inner physiology, guiding the release of the holy oil or kundalini within us. This sacred oil, also known as the Christ oil, is intimately tied to the moon's cycles, revealing a mystical connection between the celestial and the corporeal. Every month, as the moon aligns with your zodiac sign, an extraordinary event occurs within your body. The moon, with its powerful gravitational pull, governs various cycles, including the menstrual cycle for women and the holy oil cycle for both men and women. This alignment triggers the release of the holy oil, setting it on a journey through your being. The moon's passage through the zodiac signs, changing every 2.5 days within its 27-day cycle, acts as a cosmic clock, orchestrating this sacred process. At the heart of this mystical journey lies the production of the holy oil, which begins in the colostrum, located at the very center of the brain. This hallowed region, often shrouded in mystery, is adjacent to the pineal and pituitary glands, two critical centers of spiritual and physical alchemy. The colostrum, the pineal gland, and the pituitary gland form a triad of divine function, harmonizing to create and distribute this precious substance throughout the body. The moon, revered as the celestial governor of the night, emotions, water, fluids, and the mind, plays a pivotal role in this sacred process. As it moves through the zodiac, it influences the release and flow of the holy oil, akin to a cosmic conductor orchestrating a symphony of regeneration and enlightenment. This oil, infused with the essence of the divine, is the gift bestowed upon us by the heavens, a tangible link between our physical form and our higher spiritual self. This oil, once released, travels down the spine, a journey symbolic of the descent of consciousness from the celestial realms into the physical. It is here, in the sacrum, that the oil rests, awaiting the moment when we raise our vibration to elevate it back up the spine. This ascent mirrors the spiritual path, where raising the oil is akin to ascending to higher states of consciousness, ultimately reaching the pineal gland. There, it activates the crystals surrounding the pineal gland, illuminating the mind and body, ushering in a state of divine consciousness and regeneration. In the mystical lore of our inner workings, the symbolism of Santa Claus takes on a profound spiritual dimension. Santa Claus, often depicted as a benevolent figure bringing gifts down the chimney, represents the sacred journey of the holy oil within our bodies. This holy oil, produced in the colostrum at the center of the brain, begins its descent down the spine, much like Santa's mythical journey. The spine, in this sacred analogy, becomes the chimney through which this divine gift travels, ultimately reaching the sacrum. The colostrum, situated near the pineal and pituitary glands, serves as the origin point of this sacred journey. As the oil descends, it brings the potential for spiritual awakening and regeneration, akin to the gifts delivered by Santa Claus. 
This journey down the spine symbolizes the passage from the heavenly realms of consciousness into the physical domain of our bodies. Central to this mystical process are the Ida and Pingla nerves, which play a crucial role in the flow and distribution of this holy oil. The Ida nerve, associated with the pituitary gland, represents the magnetic charge and is symbolized as milk. The Pingla nerve, linked to the pineal gland, embodies the electric charge and is symbolized as honey. Together, they form the sacred land of milk and honey, a metaphor for the harmonious balance of energies within us. The pituitary gland, producing the milk, and the pineal gland, producing the honey, create a dynamic interplay of magnetic and electric forces. This balance is essential for the spiritual nourishment and enlightenment of the body and soul. As the holy oil moves through these pathways, it brings about a state of divine harmony and elevated consciousness. The spine, extending from the brain, is more than just a physical structure, it is a bridge between the celestial and the terrestrial. It mirrors the descent of consciousness from the heavenly realms into the realm of physical matter. This descent is a reflection of our journey from a state of pure, unmanifested potential into the tangible, material world. The spine, therefore, is not just an anatomical feature but a sacred conduit for the flow of divine energy. As the holy oil descends to the sacrum, it reaches the foundation of our physical being, ready to be elevated once more. The process of raising this oil back up the spine is symbolic of the ascent of consciousness, a return to the divine source from which it originated. This ascent, guided by the Ida and Pingla nerves, leads to the activation of the pineal gland, the seat of spiritual vision and enlightenment. In this intricate dance of descent and ascent, the holy oil's journey embodies the spiritual path of transformation and enlightenment. It reminds us that our physical bodies are temples of divine energy, capable of profound spiritual awakening and regeneration. This sacred process, symbolized through the timeless figure of Santa Claus, reveals the hidden mysteries of our existence and the divine potential that lies within each of us. Once the holy oil reaches the sacrum, it is poised for a transformative journey back up the spine, a journey that requires the elevation of one's vibration. This sacred ascent mirrors the biblical journey from Nazareth to Bethlehem and back, symbolizing the spiritual path of enlightenment and rebirth. In the biblical narrative, the journey from Nazareth to Bethlehem and back signifies the movement from a state of divine potential to manifestation and back to a higher state of consciousness. Similarly, the holy oil must be raised from the sacrum, the base of our physical existence, back up to the higher realms of the brain. This ascent is not merely physical but requires a profound shift in vibration, achieved through practices such as meditation, positive thinking, and maintaining a healthy, alkaline diet. As the oil ascends the spine, it travels through the Ida and Pingla nerves, the sacred channels of energy within us. This journey culminates at the pineal gland, the mystical third eye, often referred to as the seat of the soul. When the holy oil returns to the pineal gland, it performs a miraculous activation. The oil stimulates the crystals surrounding the pineal gland, causing them to illuminate the brain cells. This illumination is akin to turning on a divine light within, awakening higher consciousness and spiritual insight. The activation of the pineal gland is a pivotal moment in this sacred process. The gland, often associated with spiritual vision and enlightenment, now becomes a beacon of divine energy. The illumination of the brain cells leads to the regeneration of the entire body, creating a state of vibrant health and heightened awareness. This process is not merely symbolic but is believed to have tangible effects on the physical body, rejuvenating and revitalizing it. This ancient knowledge, held by mystics and sages for millennia, reveals the secret to regeneration and longevity. By continually raising the holy oil and activating the pineal gland, one can experience a profound renewal of the body and mind. The ancients believed that this practice allowed them to live for hundreds or even thousands of years, constantly regenerating their cells and maintaining a state of youthful vitality. 
The process of raising the oil and activating the pineal gland is a testament to the incredible potential within each of us. It speaks to the profound connection between our physical bodies and our higher spiritual selves, showing us that through dedicated practice and elevated consciousness, we can tap into the divine source of life and regeneration. This sacred journey is a reminder that we are not merely physical beings, but luminous beings of light, capable of extraordinary transformation and longevity. The process of regeneration and longevity, a profound secret known to the ancients, holds the key to living for hundreds or even thousands of years. This sacred practice involves the continual raising of the holy oil within our bodies, leading to the constant regeneration of cells. By maintaining this divine cycle, the ancients believed they could achieve extraordinary lifespans, rejuvenating their bodies and minds perpetually. Embedded within this mystical practice are rich layers of biblical and alchemical symbolism. The sacred journey of the holy oil is depicted in metaphors such as the River Jordan, the land of milk and honey, and the Eye of Ra. The River Jordan, a symbol of spiritual purification and renewal, mirrors the flow of the holy oil through our spine, cleansing and revitalizing us. The land of milk and honey, representing the pituitary, milk, and pineal, honey, glands, signifies the harmonious balance of divine energies within us, nourishing our spiritual and physical being. The Eye of Ra, an ancient Egyptian symbol of protection and royal power, reflects the awakening of higher consciousness through the activation of the pineal gland. The physiological impact of this process is profound. As the holy oil ascends the spine, it reaches the area of the vagus nerve, where a symbolic crucifixion occurs. This crucifixion represents the death of physical consciousness and the birth of spiritual consciousness. Just as Jesus was crucified at 33, the holy oil ascends through the 33 vertebrae of the spine, culminating in a spiritual rebirth. This transformation signifies the transcendence from a purely physical state to a higher spiritual state, where one attains divine awareness and enlightenment. The vagus nerve, a critical pathway in our nervous system, plays a central role in this mystical process. When the holy oil crosses this nerve, it symbolizes the crucifixion and subsequent resurrection of our spiritual self. This act of crucifixion at the vagus nerve is not merely a physical event, but a profound spiritual transformation. It marks the moment when our physical limitations are transcended, and we are reborn into a state of higher consciousness, embodying the divine light within us. This sacred process of raising the holy oil and achieving regeneration is a testament to the incredible potential within each of us. It reveals that by understanding and harnessing the ancient wisdom of our inner workings, we can unlock the secrets of longevity and spiritual enlightenment. Through the harmonious interplay of our physical and spiritual selves, symbolized by the biblical and alchemical metaphors, we can attain a state of eternal renewal and divine awareness. This journey of transformation is a reminder of our innate divinity and the limitless possibilities that lie within our grasp. Retention of one's life force, often referred to as the seed, is essential for achieving both longevity and spiritual growth. This sacred practice emphasizes the importance of conserving this vital energy, as it is the foundation of our life force and the catalyst for our spiritual ascension. To retain this precious energy, one must focus on a healthy diet, positive thinking, and disciplined living. By nurturing our body and mind, we create the ideal conditions for the holy oil to rise within us, leading to profound transformation and enlightenment. The concept of inner alchemy lies at the heart of this mystical journey. As the holy oil ascends the spine, it mirrors our spiritual ascent, culminating in the activation of the pineal gland. This small, pinecone-shaped gland, often called the third eye, is responsible for producing DMT, also known as the spirit molecule. Upon activation, the pineal gland illuminates our brain cells, opening the gateway to higher consciousness and spiritual insight. This alchemical process transforms our physical being into a vessel of divine light, revealing the deep connection between our physiological and spiritual selves. However, in modern society, 
the wisdom of these ancient practices is often undermined. The pervasive influence of sexualization and unhealthy habits can deplete the holy oil, robbing us of our vital energy and spiritual potential. Excessive indulgence in physical pleasures, poor diet, and exposure to negative influences all contribute to the loss of this sacred energy. Society's constant bombardment with material distractions and superficial values makes it challenging to maintain the purity of our life force. To counteract these modern challenges, personal practices become crucial. Maintaining an alkaline diet is essential, as it supports the body's natural balance and enhances the flow of the holy oil. Foods rich in alkaline properties help to keep our body's pH levels in check, fostering a conducive environment for spiritual growth. Meditation, too, plays a vital role in this journey. Through meditation, we quiet the mind, elevate our vibrations, and focus our energies, facilitating the ascent of the holy oil. Avoiding excessive physical pleasures is another key aspect of nurturing and raising the holy oil. While the physical realm is a vital part of our existence, it must be balanced with our spiritual pursuits. Overindulgence in physical pleasures can deplete our energy reserves and distract us from our higher purpose. By practicing moderation and mindful living, we preserve our life force and channel it towards our spiritual goals. In essence, the journey of raising the holy oil is a path of inner transformation and spiritual enlightenment. By retaining our life force, embracing inner alchemy, and adhering to disciplined personal practices, we unlock the profound potential within us. This sacred journey connects us to ancient wisdom, guiding us towards a life of longevity, spiritual growth, and divine awareness. Through conscious living and dedication, we can transcend the limitations of modern society and attain the true essence of our being. As we conclude this exploration into the mystical journey of raising the holy oil, let us reflect on the profound wisdom that has been shared. This sacred process, known to the ancients, reveals the deep connection between our physical and spiritual selves. By retaining our life force, practicing inner alchemy, and embracing disciplined personal practices, we can unlock the divine potential within us. In a world that often distracts and depletes us, it is crucial to remember the importance of nurturing our body, mind, and spirit. The journey of the holy oil, ascending the spine and illuminating the pineal gland, is a testament to the incredible power we hold within. This journey is not just a path to longevity and regeneration, but a gateway to higher consciousness and spiritual enlightenment. Let us carry this ancient wisdom into our daily lives, making mindful choices that honor our divine essence. By maintaining an alkaline diet, meditating regularly, and avoiding excessive physical pleasures, we create the perfect conditions for our spiritual growth. In doing so, we align ourselves with the cosmic rhythms and unlock the true potential of our existence. Remember, you are a being of light, capable of extraordinary transformation. Embrace this journey with an open heart and a disciplined mind, and you will discover the profound depths of your inner universe. The path to enlightenment is within you, waiting to be awakened. Thank you for joining us on this sacred exploration. May the wisdom of the ancients guide you, and may your journey be filled with light, love, and divine awareness. Until next time, continue to seek, grow, and illuminate the world with your inner light. If you enjoyed this video, why not check out our Etsy shop? We've got some unique items that we think you'll love. Click the link below to explore more. See you there.